Dixie is one of the largest uh, adult programs in the district. We have ages from 16 all the way up to 65 with a diverse background. When they walk in the door, they're welcomed. Our teachers get to know them. It's our support staff and the teaching staff. We work as a team. We offer individualized instruction. We're going to get more help, uh, more one-on-one -on -one help than you would in a traditional high school. The classes are self-paced, so some students, you know, that, that are take a little bit longer than others, it's perfectly okay. You can make your own schedule, so you don't have to come on a daily basis, you don't have to come for four whole hours. You can come for an hour and a half, three times a week, however it fits into your life. We know they may not have been successful in a traditional setting. We provide them a chance to earn their diploma and move on to a positive direction in their life. I hope that what I can take here, I can take to me with work, but knowledge-wise, and help uh, people with whatever they need help with at work. Our teachers know every line of every book and they care about the students, their passion for the students. They build a sense of community. We have a lot of satellite sites and what we do is we get to know the student and we figure out where do they live and then we guide them to that location. For the majority of my students this location is convenient. Many of my students can walk, ride their bikes, skateboard. Doing this was basically the real first step of, uh, of getting my life straight. And I really wanted to get my life in order and, and get a career rather than just work this and that jobs. For many years we've led the state in GEDs. We work with the students to figure out not what they're doing right now, but also what's their next step. So we want students to cross the stage knowing that they've been changed academically, emotionally, socially, and they have a plan. I always wanted to be a, a, um, a mechanic, you know, automotive technology, so I'm going to P-Tech uh, this year for it. Start going to college, um, probably something in the medical field. You feel like you can do it. You're given the support that you need here. Um, we also serve as students who are just moving here from other countries who are here to learn English, to either go to the workforce or they have a diploma from their country and now they want to come to St. Pete College. Our students come from many different countries, from Vietnam to Morocco to Mexico. For me, it should be a great opportunity for anybody to learn something good in another language. We are very aware of the fact that different populations of students need different attention. We take a look at the student and try to look at them not as just a language learner, but as a whole person that is trying to, you know, better their lives. We truly have a component in the middle, that transition program, that moves our student from just learning English to the next realm. I came here to, to study, to take ESO classes, but now I realize that I can take my GED. Dixie Hans is not just operating traditional classrooms. We're trying to reach deep into the community and make a long-lasting difference, where otherwise it might not have been available to those students. We also have a program in Pinellas County Jail, so students are able to earn their GED while they're completing their sentence and then return to society in a better position to get a job. Pinellas Hope is a very unique classroom location for us at Dixie Hollands. We are located right on site at one of the largest and most prominent homeless shelters in Pinellas County. I feel the benefit is having the teachers here, having the facility to go in there, you know, on my own time basically, and work on what I need to work on. Very convenient and, and it gives people a chance to achieve their dreams. They have made the commitment and the decision to overcome some obstacle or series of obstacles in their life to improve. 
I would like to go back to school for the hospitality and tourism industry. These people afford me the opportunity to study up and, and prepare me to go back to school. It is awesome. There's nothing like it to see them actually craving the learning aspect. I want to go to work somewhere. I want to, you know, get a, a get um, go to college. You know, get a skill. A certain student walked up to me and gave me a big hug and said, Mr. Mason, thank you for um, allowing me to pursue a dream. I can guarantee that when a student comes into our class, they will get the best education possible. And we go above and beyond to provide for our students whatever we can to get them to be successful in the classroom. We actually want that diploma, which is a wonderful achievement, to be just the first of many steps towards someone completely changing their life. Grab it and take advantage of it. I can't imagine anywhere else getting an opportunity like this. Thank you.